everybody. So I'm so excited. This is our first Christmas vlog. <laughs> um, I am in full Christmas mode. I am so excited. Thanksgiving is behind us. So now again, like I said, full Christmas. So this is going to be more like a home vlog style shopping type vlog, kind of a mixture. Um, we're going to start our day off at Bath and Body Works. Um, today they actually have a sale, $3 plug-in, so you better believe I'm going in Bath and Body Works. Um, they also have $10 off three wick candles. Those are my favorite. They fill the whole room, so I love it. Gonna go get some pretty Christmas scents for the house. All my pumpkin stuff is pretty much burned off as far as candles. All the pumpkin plug-ins are gone. Time for Christmas, full force. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm really excited. We're gonna go in there, see what they have. I'll show you guys how beautiful it is inside. Um, definitely visit your local Bath & Body Works. It's one of my favorite seasonal places. Um, but yeah, we're also going to be getting a tree this weekend. I'm super excited for that. This is my favorite time of the year. It really is. Besides Halloween. Halloween's number one, Christmas is number two. <laughs> I'll bring you along on our fun shopping escapades and all that good stuff. I'll show you what we get as far as tree decorations. Anyway, come inside with us and let's, let's do some shopping. No, Brittany, you are here for plugins and candles. No fragrance mist today. Here is the main event as far as what I'm here for. I only buy them when they're on sale. Oh my gosh, Bath & Body Works has some of the cutest candle holders. Okay guys, so that was an insanely successful haul. I'm so excited to get these smells going in my home, especially the balsam one. Um, I did get the fresh balsam candle. However, they were sold out. Here it is. Um, beautiful fresh balsam. <laughs> they were sold out of the plug-in. Um, so I got a lot of other Christmas scents, although they did say I could exchange some of these little plug-ins for the fresh balsam uh, when they get them back in stock. So I will be doing that. But yeah, they were only $3 when normally priced at I think like $7 for the plug-in. So really good sale. But yeah, I'm so excited. Now heading to Target. So come with me. I don't know if it's just me, but like I could get lost in Target for literally hours. <laughs> That's why I came alone. I did not torture my husband with this trip. No, Brittany, you do not need another TV. You are good on TVs. So let's get away from the temptation. No Black Friday deal on a TV. So wreaths are on sale for $20 at Target. So I may have to take advantage. These are super cute, but as you can see, not a lot of selection, kind of wiped clean, but that's to be expected. A lot of really cute options over here. Oh my gosh, and they have the cutest little stocking holders over here. Look how adorable these are. I didn't get a stocking holder. I kind of just did a little, you know, push pin in the wall. <laughs> but these are really cute. I really like these. And now the hard part, trying to find a cute tree topper out of the ones that are available. The one I really want is A1, because it's really, really pretty, but can't find it. So gonna have to probably get something else or come back later. B3 is also really cute. So I decided on this one. Looks really, really pretty. We're going with like a gold theme this year. So I think it's gonna be really pretty on our tree. Really like it. So these are gonna go perfect with our gold theme that we're going for. They're all so gorgeous. And then I also had to get this. So I think these will be super cute. And then also this one. Just goes with our theme really well. And these are on sale for $3, so couldn't resist. Super cute. And of course, what is a Christmas tree without the little candy canes that go on it? I did find some cute little stocking stuffers for my bonus son, but he might be watching this video, so can't film it. <laughs> so I had to take home this wreath. It is too beautiful. And the way that I do it, I actually do it like a table centerpiece. So I'll show you guys how it looks when I set it up. Okay, Brittany, don't get distracted. Keep to the task at hand. <laughs> Only buy stuff to decorate the tree in your house. That's all you're here for. Stop trying to Christmas shop for other people. Okay, so Target is done now. I got plenty of stuff. Got, like I said, I got a couple little things from a bonus son, but can't film it because if he's watching this video, don't want to spoil any surprises. But yeah, dollar store time because they have things like garland and other cute things at a fraction of the cost. Love Target, think they have great deals, but certain things only worth a dollar, <laughs> like little garland and stuff like that. So that's where we're headed now. See, this garland here at the dollar store is actually cuter than the one I saw at Target. So going to definitely get that one. And I put garland all around the house for the holidays, so I'm gonna be buying several of them. And lots of cute Christmas decor here, as you can see. Love all of this. And like I said, I'm doing a gold theme this year, and there's a lot of cute little gold bulbs. So excited. So I am now back at another Target because 
At the first Target, I saw hooks, I saw ornament hooks, however, they were $1.50. Me, trying to be as cheap as possible, said, I saw them at the dollar store, so I'm gonna get them at the dollar store. Went to two different dollar stores, did not have ornament hooks, neither one, they were completely sold out. So now I'm at another Target by my house trying to get ornament hooks, and I found them. So, <laughs> if you find them, get them, don't do what I did. And now for the main event, picking out a tree. It's always a hard decision. So we are shopping at Home Depot in the tree lot. I always find that they have good selections and probably some of the better prices. We found the one. Now we're just preparing it to take it home. Probably gonna stick it in the trunk. I don't know, we're gonna make it work. Okay, and here is our beautiful little naked tree. Cannot wait to decorate it. This is like an empty canvas for me. I love it. Okay guys, so we're home now and I am now working on decorating this beautiful tree. I just started putting lights up and I really, really like how some of the lights twinkle. Makes it really cute and just that much more magical. But yeah, so the lights are the most annoying part. I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> My favorite part of decorating a tree are definitely the ornaments. All looks good, but there's a big cord hanging there. So I feel like I need to move the tree over closer to that little outlet there. And I feel like there's kind of like a naked spot right there. So I gotta fix that. There we go, much better. I think I covered up that little gap. Personally, I think I need more lights, but good little start. And I moved it over to the outlet. I don't have an extension cord or anything like that, so this is gonna have to do for now, but I love the lights. The lights are some of my favorite parts of the tree. What can I say? Of course, what better candle is there to burn while decorating a Christmas tree? Fresh balsam candle from Bath and Body Works. Best candle ever, by the way. And I'm watching the Santa Claus. So, got the Christmas aesthetic going on right now. Time for the garland. And I'm gonna be honest with you, I actually like the garland better from the dollar store <laughs> than I do at Target. This beautiful gold is just, I don't know, it's too perfect, I love it. Okay, so this beautiful gold garland is coming along, but I don't think anybody wants to see me sit here and put a whole bunch of garland on the tree, so. So here's a little pixie dust to make it go faster. So garland is done. Um, yeah, it's looking really cute. I have a lot of red garland. I've got some gold garland. I have cute little green garland with little candy canes. Super, super cute. And this is what we have so far. So let me give you the full panoramic view of our tree so far. Looking pretty cute. Okay, so I've moved on to ornaments now, my favorite part. We have a cute little collection of Disney ornaments, like here's Belle. There's Ariel, she's my favorite princess, so of course she goes towards the top because I want the attention to go to her. <laughs> and then we have Cindy over here. And then we have a cute little lady in the tramp ornament. And fun fact, I've had this ornament since I was a child and my grandma actually gave me that ornament, so yeah. And now I'm just doing other cute little ornaments, like here's a cute little, little reindeer or deer ornament. I don't know, it's really cute. Looks like it's in a snow globe, <laughs> it's adorable. And then a little reindeer ornament here. And then of course the leaves, because it's the holidays. And I'm also just hanging these little gold, little they look like little icicles, little gold ornaments around. So keep with the cute little gold theme. But I will show you guys once it's done, how beautiful it looks. And then of course, last but not least, we still have to put that gorgeous little topper up that you guys saw me shop for. And just like that, our tree is finished. How beautiful is this tree? Oh my God, I'm obsessed. A beautiful skirt to kind of even the skirt out a little bit like right over there but oh my gosh i'm just so in love with this tree guys it is so beautiful they say it's the most wonderful time of the year i see why <laughs> i don't know just putting up the tree just adds so much happiness to your household let me know in the comments if you're with me on that how beautiful is this guys so here is my beautiful fall table centerpiece. It's always kind of a bittersweet thing going from the fall decor to the Christmas decor. As you guys know, fall is my favorite time of the year, but here we go. Here is Christmas. So I did make this um, Christmas table centerpiece. Things were purchased from Target, from the dollar store, from Michaels. So it's kind of just, you know, a little bit of everything, but I'm just so proud of how this turned out. And there is my Target wreath that I purchased. That's the only thing I didn't kind of put together myself. Everything else were little pieces that I purchased from different stores, but how cute is this? Okay, 
Okay, so I thought this filter would be appropriate <laughs> for the outro. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. We had an amazing time. Thank you so much for coming with us shopping, watching me decorate, and just enjoying in all the Christmas festivities at home. <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, give me a like. Uh, definitely subscribe if you want to see more stuff like this in the future. A Disney vlog is coming so, so soon. Several of you guys have asked. Thank you guys so much for all reaching out. Um, we just got a little busy. Like I said in my other video, we haven't been able to make it to the parks. The parks aren't, unfortunately, in my backyard like I wish they were. Um, again, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye. Oh, yeah. And we got a new puppy for Christmas. So here's some cute little footage of her. A little hungry girl, aren't you? Yes, you are. Om nom 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 nom. So she is an eight week old Rottweiler puppy and we named her Merida because she looks like a little bear cub and we couldn't resist the Disney dog name. I couldn't resist putting in this picture. Look at her little teeth is. <laughs> She's so cute.